Hi, I'm John Emmett here at Marina Rubicon. We've just concluded the Lanzarote International Regatta. I'm here with the champion and also the reigning Olympic champion in the 49er FX class. Please introduce yourself. Hi, my name is Martine and uh, I'm a sailor from the 49er class and it's been a rather long cycle this one with the uh, postponement of the Olympics. And it's normally a four-year cycle, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, and it's a four-year preparation for who's not from the sportive world. We, uh, it's like a four-year preparation for this one event, uh, basically. We have the Worlds every year, but it's been really hard on the sport uh, uh, in general because it's been so hard to organize events. And this is the first event we had in a very, very long time. And so it must be really nice to win it. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, it's really nice to participate in such a well-organized event. I think it was a pleasure to prepare for this and the whole, the whole thing is super nice, you know, and of course winning it is amazing. And uh, you won in your home waters in, uh, in Brazil in uh, 2016, long, seems a long time ago. I, I'm sure you would like to repeat that in, in 2021, but tell us what it was like to, to get that gold medal. Well, it was indescribable. I think it's hard to get anything better than that because uh, maybe another gold. But uh, yeah, it was uh, incredible to have all my friends there and all the, cr the crowd cheering for us. It was uh, really special and, and uh, unique to be able to do the whole preparation, the whole four year cycle in our home waters. And, and this, was this regatta was so mixed and I was just so impressed with your sailing that you were always there pulling through the fleet pulling through the feet pulling through the feet i think if we said it was mixed conditions that might have been an understatement yeah we had a little we didn't have light winds but we had a um, we had a quite a good week of like recovering from really bad situations and i think that's that that's was the skill isn't it that made us really happy because we uh, lost that for a little bit and then we uh, were able to get it again and i think yeah, I think it was our main focus to be able to recover from uh, not being so well. I mean, that's just amazing because that's the, the first thing to lose if you don't do much racing. And you just said, you know, n nobody's done any racing for such a long time. Yeah, I think uh, consistency was definitely a key for this uh, event. And uh, dare I ask, in this very changeable w world, what's, what's your next event and your next training plan? We uh, plan to stay here in Lanzarote for a little bit longer. It's, uh, it's been real amazing here. Uh, these waters have been uh, super nice uh, conditions and also the, the climate here has been very good for Brazilians. <laughs> you know, we, we don't tolerate the cold very well. You say that for an Englishman, it's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is amazing. And uh, next we go to Portugal and we'll expect to do some training in Cascais. It's uh, our you know, I think the whole fleet and all the other fleets, it, we can't plan much further than two weeks because the, everything is changing all the time. And so that's uh, as far as we go, two weeks. Perfect. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, thank you ever so much for your time. Lovely to chat to you and best of luck for the future. Thank you very much. <laughs>